So, I've wanted to have a dog since we started dating. <laughs> and we had an apartment in Boston and we could not have a dog there. So once we moved to a house, that was my big priority besides actually moving in, was finding a dog that we could adopt. And I grew up with Australian Shepherds, so I grew up with dogs that were this breed, and I love this breed, I always have. They're very active, they're high energy, but they're a lot of fun. And we also wanted to adopt, so I was searching for a very long time to find a dog that really needed a home. And one day I came home from work, I worked the night shift as a nurse, and I came home from work and it was 7.30 in the morning, and on Pet Finder we found Autumn. And I think I called him in the middle of his day and I was like, we absolutely have to adopt her. She's beautiful, I love her. She's in Louisiana, she's been chained to a tree with 14 other dogs and we have to give her a home. And so we contacted the foster mom who is also a night nurse and we had a connection right away. And We talked about her and I talked about my history with raising Australian Shepherds and she thought we were a good fit. So rescue road trips brought her up from the South, they do this amazing journey where they go to Texas and Louisiana and they pick up all these dogs and bring them up to the Northeast and we picked her up in Connecticut three months later and it's been the best thing we ever did. So actually growing up, I never had a dog and my family, you know, we weren't necessarily dog people. Uh, and Erin and her family, mm -hmm. Uh, I'd say would be the opposite. <laughs> Total dog people. <laughs> but um, I, I, you know, fell in love with Aaron's dogs, and you know, and there was immediate connection with me, even to the point where when we go over Aaron's parents' house, the dogs will, you know, run through her legs <laughs> and then right up onto my chest, um, which I really didn't like. <laughs> <laughs> right. But I've actually found that. When I come home to an empty house and Autumn's there to greet me, it's, you know, one of the best parts of my day. Despite the name, Australian Shepherds aren't from Australia. <laughs> As a matter of fact, they're uh, a uniquely American breed. One of the distinctive characteristics is the uh, cropped tail, uh, and it's believed that American ranchers would uh, crop the tail uh, in order to prevent it from being trampled in a herd or caught in a barbed wire fence. Um, and that was actually the way the tax collector would come and count how many working dogs you had on the farm. If it had a tail, they knew it was a pet versus um, a working dog could be uh, accounted for. She needs to run every day, and if she doesn't run with us every day, by the end of the day she comes and brings toys and puts them in our lap like, okay, let's do something now. I have so much energy. Or she'll just start running laps around the house because she just needs to get it out. So we run her, there's trails at the end of our street, and we run her usually three miles a day every day and walk her in between so she's getting enough activity. And then still she wants to play on top of that. but. If we're not religious about it, she'll tell us pretty quickly. And if we're not quick enough getting out the door, she nips at our heels to get us faster to the door. It is a real, true herding dog. She had never seen snow before yeah. until uh, this past December. And we've been looking forward to it. Uh, and unfortunately, Aaron was working that day. Yeah, you loved it. <laughs> yeah, there was uh, an initial trepidation where she was unsure of what is yeah. this white stuff. She wouldn't step outside. She was sniffing it and she touched her paw to it <laughs> and um, you know once she overcame that initial fear um, within seconds yeah she was having a ball and uh, digging in the snow, eating the snow, rolling around in it and uh, yeah so it doesn't matter you know rain, sleet or snow uh, she does it all. She's actually uh, quite the climber, so we've been doing some of the high peaks in the Adirondacks, and she's summited two of them. Mm -hmm. And uh, some of these peaks where there's stone rock faces, and the beauty of Autumn is, you know, no matter what the terrain, she can, she can pass it. The other thing that's kind of unusual for her is she loves to swim, which is not typical of Australian Shepherds at all. And she will jump off the boat and swim in the lake, she'll jump into ocean, she'll go anywhere and she loves, loves, loves to swim, which is so, so unusual <laughs> for this kind of dog. I think that Autumn is one of the best things that we've ever done and adopting a dog is so important. She's 
we gave her the gift of a home, but really she's given us such a gift. She's a joy in our life. We're so lucky to have her.